All right, welcome back to the channel. Haven't done a video in a couple weeks because I really haven't had time. Uh, worked 80 hours last week and I got 60 this week. Now I do need to mow because we finally got some rain. So I guess I'll just make a video out of that because that's what I got to do. So also I've been doing these videos for about a year, so, you know, just something to do for fun. So it's kind of hard to put out a vid video every week or be consistent about it but uh i'm gonna try to i got some other projects coming along so hey what are you doing today pretty hot out here today ain't it buddy but it's nice and cool in this garage ain't it right hey come here lay down in front of the fan here that'd be a nice cool spot for you there big guy gonna take a little break here uh, but this little s240 it can really make some tight turns you know it's not gonna outperform a uh, zero turn but it really whips around for a garden tractor style lawnmower I guess you'd call it but so far so good I'm gonna take a break and uh, go down there and check up on the apple trees and stuff so well, here's an update on the uh, Norway spruce trees that I planted a few videos ago. Now, it's been so dry out here. This one here looks like it's dead. This one here is doing pretty good. I've been watering these trees. You can see by the grass growing around it. But like I said, it's been so dry. That one's dead. And the next two in line are dead, too. But all these little trees here, they're doing good. Now this one's getting a little stressed out there. Now here's the apple trees I pruned back in winter time. Back in February, I think it was. But they're getting quite a bit of apples. They haven't been getting much rain, so it's... And when I prune these trees, these uh, branches, I trimmed them up so that the old square body could get underneath them, the truck. And look at them, they're already hanging down. Uh, we got here's an apple here. That one looks pretty good. But it's pretty early for them to be dropping. Got quite a few on the ground already. But we haven't got much rain, so that could be the problem. And here's that tree that fell over in the storm a few years back. It's uh, It's got quite a bit of apples on them. Still alive. It's going to be pretty good for maybe deer to come up and eat. But 
I'm gonna have to trim these mulberry trees out of here. Get them out of there and maybe that tree will even grow pretty good. And here's one of the pear trees. They look like they're getting a little bit of stress because these leaves are dying. The pears seem kind of small for this time of year. But I didn't prune them. I didn't get to it, so. There's a lot of the dead that needs to be trimmed off these trees. Check out these blackberries. So many on there, it's knocking the branch down. This one here doesn't have any thorns on it. Must be one of them thornless blackberry bushes. There's more blackberry bushes. There's quite a few out here. Here's some grapes. They're not doing too good. Put you up there on the wire there, bud. Here's the cherry trees I planted this year, this spring. There's one, one over there. They're doing pretty good. Another little apple tree. It's not got nothing on it. It's too little. This tree here that's got these little bitty apples on them, that's what they are. I think it's a crab apple tree. Now, these trees here I didn't plant. And then I had the big fire, and it, I thought it killed them all, and then they came back up. That's been 10 years ago. Well, not quite 10 years ago. But, uh, so yeah, maybe it has been about 10 years. But I'm not really sure what type of apple trees they are, but. Pretty sure that's a crab apple. Now here I'm on the east side of the old wick building. I've been starting to work on this and I'm gonna make a video of it. But like I said, I worked 80 hours last week and I think I had 60 the, the following this week and I had time to work on it. And the sweet corn this year, I planted about the same as last year. Uh, I planned on doing a half an acre or something or a quarter of an acre and giving it away to people but didn't have time plus it's pretty good we didn't get that much rain i'd be irrigating a half acre of sweet corn that'd be be kind of tough but we got some rain and you can see the corn's coming up pretty good oh it's head high and it's the fourth of july so all right well it's time to mow along the roadside so i got the high viz on and we'll get the John Deere 75 out of the shed here and get that done.
Well, while we think about it, we'll go ahead and start the square body up because it hadn't been started in a long time. Come on, be good. Started. Took a little while. Actually, the, the fuel filter was dry. It had no fuel up here, so I had to crank it, crank it, and it finally took off. Well, that's going to be it for this video. Like I said, I didn't have nothing to do to make a video about, so I just went ahead. I had to mow, so I made a mowing video. Uh, if you like it, give it a thumbs up. Uh, if you want to see more, subscribe, and thanks for watching.